What is going on, happy people? This video is for you. It's for all the subscribers out there who helped to make 2018 absolutely amazing. Dusty Gert. Dusty Gert, you win. Now, <laughs> my friend Tim Glom, he's going to message you. He's going to send you an email. And I don't know what you're going to win yet, but I guarantee you it's going to be a really good gift. I may give away custom teak cutting boards to everybody, or who knows, but I guarantee you're gonna get a really cool gift. That's what I can promise you. And it's not gonna be like just a cheesy nothing. The first video actually is the first video of the entire year, and it happened on this lake right here behind me, catching white bass. And the comment is for Skylar Schaefer. I've been going through depression for the past two months. But every time I see these videos, no matter how sad I'm feeling, they just make me, they just make my day. You know, I've had a lot of instances over the past five years where I've made a video and I've had people reach out to me and say how it affected them and how it helped them. Now, there's no amount of comments or likes or anything that means more to me than making a video that makes someone happy or relieves depression or brightens their day. That means a ton to me and it means my videos are doing more than just creating views and thumbs up. It's changing people's lives. And so for that, I wanna say, Skylar, I hope you're doing well. I hope your depression has gone away and I hope you're living life to the fullest, enjoying every single day as much as you can. So, God bless, brother. Now. Let's give away another gift. Jack Fashing? Jack Fashing, you're a winner! <laughs> like I said, Tim Glom is gonna be contacting you and we're gonna be giving away gifts, really cool gifts to all of you. The second one is Wild Boar and Whitetail Deer Catch, Clean, Cook, two full videos in one. It is heartwarming to see a man love and appreciate his wife and children so much. You're a great example to the young men who look up to you. Blessings to your family. Thank you very much. Um, nothing is ever perfect. Like, we're a normal married couple, we're a normal parents, and life goes through ups and downs, and just like anything, you figure out how to make the best of it and do the best you can at it. Rob always says the seas aren't always flat and they're not always rough. Uh, third one is Charles Ryle. Charles Ryle, come on down. The next one is, the video is, an amazing fish during a family picnic, lots of surprises. I remember that, that's the first time we took Aria fishing. Yeah. And I hooked a big old tarpon right there in Dubois Park. I remember that video like it was yesterday. We had so much fun. That one was so little. But, this comment comes from Vermont Brothers. Mr. Rob, my name is Adam, I live in Vermont. I have watched your videos for about a year. I wanted to tell you that you and your family are more than a vlog. You literally saved my life. 12 months ago, I had a terrible thing happen in my life and I seriously was considering suicide. The day I was going to do it, I came across your channel and after watching only a few videos, I felt like I didn't want to end anymore. end it anymore. It's the passion you have for people and life that saved mine. And I may not know you, but I feel like family with every video I watch. I can never, oh, I don't know what the rest of it said, but I oh, it's it, it says I can never, I, I can never repay you. You don't owe me anything. And what I want to say to you is suicide is real. It's not, it's not something that happens to other people. It's ha it happens to, People you know. So many people. And if you or anyone you know is battling depression or contemplating suicide, man, I promise you, I promise you, as she said, the ocean's not always calm and the ocean's not always rough. Reach out to somebody. I wish so much that, that Vicky would have reached out to me. There are other people that I know who have, who have committed suicide. I wish they would just reach out. And if, if you're battling it, reach out to somebody because I guarantee you I promise you there are people who love you far more than you know and will be there to help you. So the ocean's not always calm, the ocean's not always rough. Uh, to the Vermont brothers, I certainly hope you're doing great and I hope that 
that you're in calm seas with the sun on your face. I love you and I hope you're doing well. Um, comments like this help us to know that we're making a difference and that we're doing a good job. And this isn't about views or thumbs up. This is about changing people's lives and giving people hope and making people smile. Now, let's give away another gift. Roderick Alexander. Guess what? You win. You win. <laughs> Kingfish, catch, clean, and cook. Caramel glazed smoked fish dip. And the comment is, I think if there's one channel that taught me how to appreciate life more, it's this one. Amazing video, keep it up. This just falls right in that line. I love comments like this, but I want to tell you the backstory in this video that you would have never seen if you just watched the video. I actually went out with my brother and they, my brother and one of his bros, and I spent like $200 on live bait. We went out, the fishing in all honesty was terrible. It, we didn't catch Jack, but I kept, I stayed positive. I was like, man, all we need is one good fish and we're gonna make this an awesome video. We were literally like one minute away from leaving. Bow! Goggle eye gets eaten, come tight, catch a big kingfish, and we make the video. Now, if you watch the video, all you see are good times and smiles and having fun. What you don't see is the fact that we fished all day, barely got any bites, it was so annoying, but we pulled it out. And that's how a lot of fishing days are. You don't remember the times where you're not getting bit. You remember the times when you're fighting fish and that's how life is. Mm -hmm. Life isn't always smiles and hurrah. There's a lot of grind and there's a lot of pain in life, but you fight through it. And the next thing you know, you're standing out in freezing temperature <laughs> with no glove on your hand. <laughs> with a smile on your face. With a smile on your face. So that's what it's all about. Let's give away another gift. Are you guys enjoying this? Are you enjoying just hanging out with us right now? I hope so. If you are, please leave a thumbs up. I kind of feel bad because Rob's been all talking and we haven't, me and the girls, haven't been on the channel much lately, but we've we've also been just so busy. And you guys know, I mean, if you have kids, you, it's just a lot of work. So I, the kids are my job. I take care of them to the best ability that I can. And Rob does a lot of work. So I am behind the scenes doing work. We just haven't done it. Hey, All right. and she's going with me to the UP tomorrow whoop, whoop, whoop. or, or Wednesday. Wednesday, fishing for all kinds of awesome stuff. We're going with a guy named Larry Smith, the guy that I filmed right out here with. Okay, number four. Okay, uh, let's see, Willie Hicks. No, that's not the right one. Well, let's, we're okay. gonna, <laughs> Willie Hicks, Sorry. you're a winner. <laughs> you are now. You were gonna be, but yeah, you were just a little I bit just, farther down the line. I, I got ahead of myself. What do you have? What do you have wrong with P. McCollum? Why didn't you call oh. his name? Okay, you're winner. <laughs> I got screwed up because Alex. Did, okay, yeah, I got screwed up. Bow fishing, catch and cook, Rob versus Sarah challenge. No. Now the comment that I'm going to read here is: This is the first time I have ever seen one of your videos, and I have to say that I was extremely refreshing to see you lead your family in prayer before dinner. Hey, yeah. that's just the way we live. Our videos are a reflection of our life. I don't. I don't say the blessing every single time I pick up a food to eat, but when we sit around as a family and oftentimes as friends, we always say the blessing. And no matter what, every day of my life, every time I put a piece of food in my mouth or take a step, I'm thankful to have that opportunity. So saying the blessing is a form of being thankful and being thankful for what you have and what you don't have is a key part of life. No, let me just show you uh, bow fishing, catch and cook, Rob versus Sarah challenge. That video has over 3.3 million views. Gosh, but let so me bad. give you the backstory on that. We were sitting at the house, like bored. There was nothing really good to do. It was kind of a crummy weather day. The boat wasn't, I wasn't done with the boat. There, there was like really not a lot to do. I'm like, honey, let's go do something. She's like, what do you want to do? I'm like, I don't know. Let's, uh, let's grab some bows and go up bow fishing. Okay. And we literally took something and just made a video. We went out, we had a blast, shot a bunch of fish. I just so happened to have some, some uh, swordfish from, from Nick Stanzik in the cooler, then we cooked it up. And that's how life is. Don't sit on the couch and wallow in pity saying there's nothing to do. Dad gum, get up and go do something. It doesn't matter even if it's really, really small. Walk, go to a park, go for a walk. 
call someone that you haven't talked to in a long time. Like today, Larry Frederick, love you brother. He texts <laughs> me and I haven't talked to him in forever. I'm happy. Reach out and just go through your phone and say, who haven't I talked to? Call him and say, man, let's go do something. Adam. Adam Johnson, love you too, brother. So many people out there that over the past year I've, I've been able to connect with and you just reach out and don't sit on the couch and wallow in pity because that's how you stay on the couch. You gotta just get up, jerk yourself up and go do something. I don't care if you have no money to spend, I promise you, you can find something to do. We did. And well, make, we did. Yeah, and make the most out of your day. Because 2019 is about doing more and being better. Okay, um, Austin Lane. Austin Lane. You're a winner. North Korean snap recipe, catch, clean, and cook. Comment. When making fried rice, in terms of the egg, cook it by itself. Move all the rice to the side to give you some space to fry the eggs. It creates a much better texture than just mixing it with the rice. It also allows the eggs to shine more in the dish. And then there are like 380 thumbs up on that comment and so many replies to that comment. And what I want you to know is, whenever I do these videos, I learn so much from you. Like I get I get video ideas, I learn tips, I, know, I figure out what I'm doing right, I figure out what I'm doing wrong, and you encourage me to be better at what I'm doing. Now, the reason that's one of my favorite comments is because I love fried rice, but I never knew how to stink and make it right. And I knew it tasted okay, but it looked terrible. When I made this <laughs> dish and I read that comment, then I started cooking the egg separately, adding it to, and BAM! We're in the house. Okay, next up, David Ding. Ding! You're a winner. Insane Fish Frenzy. Fleer. Cast and blast, catch clean cook with swamp cabbage. The best stuff ever. This is a shout out to Athea Nichols. If you are like a, a pretty, like if you read and comment a lot, you know Athea Nichols. She leaves these totally awesome comments and she's awesome. got a hundred emojis on there. Yes. She's always super happy. <laughs> and so there is no way I could do this without including Athea. Miss Athea Nichols, we love you and we appreciate you yes. here at Deer Meat for dinner. Love you, Hi, Arrington family, waiting for this video. Thank you for sharing another wonderful video. What a way to enjoy the weekend watching a Deer Meat for Dinner video. Makes my day. Good afternoon, Grandma, and hi, Sarah, Aria, and Emma. Emma Jean. Have yourselves a wonderful week, all together as the beautiful family you are. God bless, bye, emoji. That's awesome. <laughs> That's just so prototypical of her, so encouraging, so yes. supportive, yeah. so loving. We thank you for that. Yeah, very heart heartfelt. Jason Gonzalez. Jason Gonzalez, I don't know what you won, but you just won something. <laughs> uh, the next one, massive Dungeness Crab Catch, Clean and Cook with Underwater View. That video was so much fun. Like I was wanting to put a camera down there. I was anticipating, oh my gosh, please work. And then it did. That was so epic. That was just such an epic video. Sorry uh, guys, we're running on little sleep, so I apologize for the yawn. And, and this <laughs> hair on my face itches so bad. I hate it. I'm shaving it the second I get home. Um, the comment. I love these videos. Rob is always so positive and always cranks out the best conduct for content for the fans and is so good to his family. It'd be awesome to get up to meet him and go on a hunt with him one day. Love the video, great content. Easily my favorite YouTube channel without a close second. Who thinks I should do more meet and greets? Like I, I wanna start doing meet and greets everywhere we go because the best way for me to no, y'all is to do meet and greets. I mean, I can read comments and I, I love that, but I love shaking your hands, giving Put you hugs, and me. actually seeing you. So if you think meet and greets are a good thing, leave it in the comments below. Um, that comment was amazing and it just is so epic. Okay, next one. Matthew Mess. You're a mess, but you're a winner. <laughs> uh, thank you. That's the video. It was on July 27th, 2018. We hit 1 million subscribers. Huge milestone. So I want to say thank you again. And this comment actually comes from my friend, Brandon J. Jigging with Jordan. It says, congratulations, bro. Couldn't have happened to a more deserving guy. You inspire so many, including myself. Congratulations on your success. And here's to more amazing adventures. You guys, I gotta give a huge shout out to Brandon J. If you've never seen his channel, it's Jiggin' with Jordan. I've 
I'm not a big collaborator. I don't like doing collaborations because just, I don't know. I, I probably should do more collaborations, but I just really enjoy getting up and doing my thing. The collaboration I did with Jiggin' with Jordan was amazing because that dude rocks it, lives life to the fullest, always has a smile on his face, and he is a giver. I mean, like, he shouted me out on his channel. We got a pile of new subs, and I want to say thank you, Brandon J. Go check out Jiggin' with Jordan. And if you think I should do another video with Jiggin', drop a big thumbs up. Okay, so next up, Clinton Lopez. Clinton really? Lopez, you pulled it out right at the end there, man. It was like coming down to the end. Now we do have a couple more, but you were down there near the bottom. It doesn't matter, you're still a winner. <laughs> Lobster and lionfish, catch, clean, and cook, a family tradition. The comment says, Rob, you may not know the impact of your videos. The happiness you bring into someone's life in just a short 10 minutes video. My wife and I have gone through a super rough patch this past year. And after watching you and your wife's relationship makes me realize that the bond as adults is what gets us through every day. Thanks for the amazing videos. We appreciate y'all. Peace, my friend. See, the peace, my friend, kept me from being annoyed that that dude sounds like he's dragging a tambourine through the parking lot. <laughs> he kind of is. <laughs> <laughs> People are ice fishing. You can't blame them. Yeah, this it's a just. Beautiful day to go ice fishing. Yeah, it is a beautiful day, but it really is. That's look, man. If you were to be in our house 24/7, you would see that we <laughs> argue and fuss just like every other couple <laughs> in the entire world. That's mm. no doubt. But look, we're not quitters. You get into something, you make a commitment, you roll. Yeah. Um, if you were in a truck and you got into a mud hole and you're like, crap, that's it. I'm leaving the truck right here, and you just walk away then you'd be like, uh, you'd be stupid. You would never leave your truck in a mud hole just because you got stuck. You'd figure out how to get your truck out of the mud hole and that's how relationships are. So this is my theory in a relationship. When you're frustrated as a, as a woman, as a wife, as a girlfriend, whatever, that the husband doesn't pick up clothes, you have to always remember, and whatever it may be, that if he was not here, you would miss the mess to pick up. So appreciate it because that means they're with you and that you have them to hold on to. Winner. <clears throat> Albert Moorhead. You're a winner. Winner, chicken dinner. Winner, winner, dear Give meat me for, for dinner. dinner. Dude, who thinks we should make that into a shirt? Yeah. I've been thinking we about need that. Shirt. We, we need shirt it. ideas. Yeah, In the comments seriously. below, leave shirt ideas. And if you see a shirt idea that you like, just thumbs up and, and any of them get a bunch of thumbs up, we're making the shirt. A journey into the unknown, road of CNMI. That was the video and the comment. I'm honestly a little surprised you had multiple fans notice you so readily in Saipan across the world. That's something, huh? The, the internet's global reach is truly incredible. That is so true and is so amazing. Like literally people from all over the world watch our videos. I was so blown away flying into Guam, Saipan, Rota, ever. I mean, so many people were, were like subscribers. I pull into houses and they already had Everglades sitting there that they ordered from like from watching the channel. And wherever you are in the world, I love you and I appreciate you being a part of the channel. You are awesome. And 2019, man, we're gonna be doing some awesome traveling to some awesome places. And if you think we should visit your country, leave the name of the country yes. in the comments below because we are gonna do we are piling up the miles this year. Yeah. Jared Carey. You're a winner! Woo! Jared Carey. Now, everyone, don't click off the video just because we're done, because we are going to give one more name. Yes. There's one more person out there that we are calling your name. This is the last comment of the day. Sarah's biggest deer, hunt and taxidermy, giant Oklahoma buck. And the comment is, on the first day of Christmas, my true love came to me, a mounted deer from American taxidermy. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you very much. I love that. I, just, I, I kept saying that while I was reading it. And to a very Merry Christmas to all. Thank you very much. <laughs> Merry Christmas, everybody. You have made 2018 more than a dream come true. And I sincerely yeah. want to thank you. Last person is... Brian Leonard. I know you're watching this till the end, too. Brian Leonard. <laughs> With You're going to get something cool. Yeah, with my nose frozen and snot running everywhere, <laughs> I want to say thank you. 
yeah. you guys tomorrow's christmas and we hope to do a couple more videos by year's end i promise you to make 2019 the best i possibly can take care god bless we go stop watching you bunch of crazies no you filthy animal <laughs>